Justice Ahmed Mohammed of the Federal High Court in Abuja has dismissed a suit seeking disqualification of the All Progressives Congress and Bola Ahmed Tinubu over the nomination of a Muslim Muslim candidacy for the 2023 presidential election. The suit instituted by an Abuja-based legal practitioner, Sigwe Momo, was thrown out by the judge on the grounds that the plaintiff lacked the uh, local standing to institute the case. Judiciary correspondent Celestina Iria reports. Justice Mohammed, in dismissing the suit, held that the lawyer had not been a member of the APC and did not participate in the process that produced Bola Tinibu and his running mate, Kashim Shatima, and thus cannot query the party on its nominations. The legal practitioner had in the suit prayed the court for an order, nullifying the candidate of APC and Ashiwaju Tinibu from participating in the presidential election on grounds that the nomination of Muslim Muslim candidacy is unconstitutional. Specifically, the lawyer who claimed to be an apostle of the rule of law and social justice argued that Muslim Muslim candidacy was contrary to the spirit of national cohesion, integration and unity. He asked the court for an order of perpetual injunction to the Independent National Electoral Commission from publicizing the name of APC and its presidential candidates for the next general election. However, in his judgment, Dr. Mohammed disagreed with the plaintiff on the legal right to institute the case and subsequently dismissed it in its entirety. As a Nigerian, if I can hold the constitution, if I can swear to the constitution, then I have a right to ask that the constitution should be interpreted. And basically, that's, 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 and regardless of the consequence of that interpretation. As a matter of fact, this judgment simply means that we will not interpret the, con the constitution because the consequence will mean that some person may lose political position. The plaintiff in his originating summons held that the nomination of the presidential and vice presidential candidates being from the same religious faith is exclusionary and can possibly polarize the country towards the religious faith and is against the sacrosanct principle of social justice. Celestina Iria, TVC News.